Hey guys, it's MJ the Student Act Tree, and what I want to show you in this video is how to draw five cards from a normal playing card deck. So what we have in my app is you click play and you can see that we have drawn some of those standard cards. Um, I've also got it so that you can click swap cards and you know possibly go for the flash. But how do I draw these five cards? You know, how do I do it so that every time I draw, I'm getting different cards that do not repeat themselves. That's the big thing. You don't want two eights of spades coming up. So how do we do it? Well, I'm going to show you the code. What I do, or what the general philosophy is, is I'm going to be generating two random numbers for each card. The first random number I call the suit. So what I do is, I, this is an Android Studio, I'm going to create a random variable using this code. So random S1 equals new random. And then this random uh, value is going to be assigned to something which I call the suit. So suit1 is going to take a random number between 1 and 4. So it can be 1, 2, 3, or 4. This represents clubs, hearts, diamonds, spades. Um, so I'm going to create a random variable for that. Then I'm also going to create another random variable for the number. And this number is going to take a random uh, value between 1 and 13. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to say the card suit is equal to suit 1 and the card number is equal to num1. And because this is my first card, I simply assign these values. But now when I come to the second card, I need to have a little bit of a check and what I have done is I've created a while loop so what I do oh what did I click there whoops okay yeah we back here so what what I do is I create exactly the same how I did before create another random variable between 1 and 4 and then another random variable between 1 and 13 and I assign the cards but I then have this while loop and I say while suit 1 equals suit 2 and num1 equals num2, I want to generate another random variable and assign those cards. So what this means is that, let's say we get ace of spades here, and then we get ace of spades again, this while loop is going to say, uh-uh, these guys are the same, let's generate another random variable, and it's going to stay in this loop until we generate another card. So remember, but both the suits and the numbers have to be the same because we don't mind if we have two aces, if we have the ace of hearts and the ace of diamond. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to assign the card. Now, when I want to draw the third card, you can see my logic gets a little bit longer. I need to make sure that suit 3 isn't the same as suit 1 and num 3 is equal to the same as num 1. But I also need to make sure that card 3 is not the same as card 2. And again, I'm going to do the while loop. When I draw the fourth card, I need to make sure that the fourth card is not the same as the first card, not the same as the second card, and not the same as the third card. And then this is going to go in again. And then finally for the fifth card, you can see the logic does get a little bit long, because um, now we have to check that it's not the same as the first, not the same as the second, not the same as the third, not the same as the fourth. But essentially what we're doing is we're just having a while loop where we're regenerating our random numbers, reassigning and then checking the condition and by doing that what we can achieve is we can achieve every time that we click play we're going to see random cards coming up no duplicates and there we go that is how we assign random cards from the 52 card deck and making sure that there are no duplicates thanks guys so much for watching and check out my other videos around how i made this poker app specifically how i did these little swap um, I'll show you guys how I did that in another video. But feel free to download this app. The, uh, the link is in the description below. Thanks guys so much for watching. Cheers.